Bad bugs, identify insects and bug bites. One tick bites. Most commonly, ticks attach to warm, moist, and hard to see parts of the body including the scalp, armpits, groin, skin folds, and other hairy areas. Ticks must be removed properly to minimize the chances of infection from these insects. Wear appropriate clothing outdoors to reduce exposure. Use tick repellent with DEET. Check for ticks on your body if you spend time in the woods. 2. Lyme disease. A Lyme disease causing bacterium is carried in the bug bite of the deer tick, in the northeastern, mid-Atlantic and north-central US, or the western black leg tick on the Pacific coast. In most cases, the tick an insect about 3 to 5 mm long must be attached 36 to 48 hours to spread Lyme disease. A circular, red, expanding rash, erythema migrans, or a bull's eye rash, may be one of the first symptoms of Lyme disease. Other symptoms include fatigue, chills, fever, headache, muscle and joint aches, and swollen lymph nodes. Treatment in the early stages with antibiotics is generally effective. 3. Poisonous Black Widow Spiders Black widows are about one half inch wide, with a shiny, black, globular abdomen that has the distinctive red hourglass on the underside. Only the female of the species bites humans. They live throughout the US, but most are found in the southern regions. 4. Black Widow Bites Black widow spider bite symptoms usually start 20 minutes to 1 hour following the bite, and can include pain, though not all people experience pain. Other symptoms include muscle cramps and spasms, abdominal pain, tremors, weakness, or a rise in blood pressure. Seek medical attention immediately. Treatment includes antivenin, which counteracts the spider toxin, and pain medications if necessary. 5. Brown Recluse Spiders Brown recluse spiders are extremely poisonous, and their bug bites can cause infection and illness. They are found mostly in the Midwestern and Southeastern US. They are yellowish tan to dark brown in color with darker legs that are about 1 inch in length. They have a characteristic violin pattern on their back. Brown recluse bites Brown recluse bites are usually painless, but some may feel like a mild bee sting. Symptoms of a brown recluse bug bite include severe pain at the site of the bite that develops about 4 hours after the bite, followed by severe itching, nausea, vomiting, fever, and muscle pain. See a doctor immediately if you think you have been bitten by a brown recluse spider bite. If possible, bring the spider to the ER for proper identification. 6. Head Lice Head lice are about 2 to 3 mm mm, long, and they infest the head and neck area, usually hidden in your hair. These insects spread through direct contact with the hair of a person infested with head lice. It is most common among preschool and elementary school aged children, and members of the household of children who are infested with head lice. Head lice are not known for spreading disease, however, they may cause itching, and scratching may lead to infection. Head Lice Remedies Treatment is recommended for anyone with an active infestation of head lice. Pediculocytes, medicines that kill lice, may be prescribed by your doctor. Wash all clothing and bedding used by the person infested with these bugs. Often, it is recommended that family members also be treated at the same time to prevent further head lice infestation. 7. Fleas, not for pets only. Fleas are not just a problem for FIDO these blood-sucking bugs bite people, too. Fleas are about 2.5 mm mm, long, they are reddish-brown in color, and while wingless, they can jump large distances. They suck blood from their host to feed. Flea Bites Some people may develop an allergic reaction to a flea bite. Scratching a flea bite itch can cause the skin on and around the bitten area to break open, which can lead to infection. Keep these insects away by making sure all pets in your home are on flea preventative products, keeping your home clean, and treating any flea infestations that may occur. 8B, Hornet, Wasp, Yellow Jacket The stings of bees, wasps, hornets, and yellow jackets can cause severe reactions in people who are allergic to their stings. 
Normal reactions include pain, redness, and swelling around the site of the sting. B. Hornet, wasp, yellow jacket stings. If you are allergic to bees, hornets, wasps, or yellow jackets, seek emergency care immediately to prevent or manage an anaphylactic reaction. Use an EpiPen, epinephrine, if you have one. In all cases, remove the insect's stinger if possible to avoid receiving more venom, tweezers may help, and clean the sting area with antiseptic. You may take over-the-counter antihistamines for itching or hives, and over-the-counter nonsteroidal anti-inflammatories, NSAIDs, for pain and inflammation. 9. Fire Ants The red imported fire ant is found mainly in the southern US. They are reddish-brown to reddish-black and have a stinger. They build large dirt mounds, usually in sunny areas. Bug bites from fire ants are usually painful, and will cause itchy, raised areas on your skin, hives, followed by pimple-like, pus-filled blisters. Fire Ant Stings When a fire ant bites you, you will feel it. An itchy hive will develop. Hours later, a blister filled with pus can form. If you suffer from a severe allergic reaction to a fire ant bite, these bug bites can be life-threatening. Seek medical care immediately. Otherwise, to help relieve the pain and itching, use over-the-counter pain relievers and antihistamines. Do not break the blisters, and keep the area clean to avoid secondary infection. 10. Chiggers Chiggers are a type of mite from the family known as Trombiculidae. They are barely visible to the naked eye, and in their juvenile, larval, form, they can bite humans. Chiggers found in the US do not spread disease, but their bites can cause intense itching and small red bumps. Chigger Bites Itching from chigger bites is most intense one to two days following the bite. When the chigger falls off it can leave red welts that may resemble a blister or pimple. Scratching can lead to a secondary infection, so treatment is directed at relief of itching symptoms. Use over-the-counter antihistamine creams to help relieve itching and prevent scratching. Consult your doctor if you have concerns. 11. Scabies Scabies are mites that burrow into the skin, causing intense itching. Scabies spread by close contact with a person infested with scabies, or by sharing towels, sheets, and other personal items with a person infested with scabies. Treating Scabies it can take weeks after the scabies mites burrow into the skin before you will experience severe itching or rash, with small blisters or sores. The intense itching is usually worse at night. Most commonly, the itching will be between the fingers, on the outside of the elbows or armpits, around the waistline, or on the buttocks. Scabies can only be cured with medicated creams, lotions, or pills. Family members who share a household with a person infested with scabies may also be prescribed treatment. 12. Bed Bugs Bed bugs are reddish-brown, and less than 1 mm mm, in size. They are frequently found in bedding, but can also be found in areas of clutter, or in old furniture. Bed Bug Bites Most of the time, the reaction to a bed bug bite is mild, and usually in the form of small, red, itchy bumps. Treatment includes over-the-counter cortisone creams and antihistamines to relieve the itch. Excessive scratching can cause a secondary infection. Subscribe here for more scientifically proven videos and thanks for watching.